fellas, <laughs> welcome to a new series, potential series on the channel. I'm going to play a genius interview clip for you. I'm going to mm, cut it off okay. right before they say something stupid, something absurd, something ridiculous yeah. even. I'm just going to leave uh -huh. you to guess what they say. I'm not going to give you any prompts because that'd be too easy. I'm just going to let you guess. And whoever gets bruh. the closest guess gets a point. This <laughs> this, this idea is fucking genius, bro. Who the fuck came Yo. Up? As per usual, whoever gets the most points gets to add something permanently to my Twitter banner. And um, as you're watching along, remember to play along. Uh, comment your funniest, your closest guess. I'll leave a heart on the comments I find funniest, so just go wild. I will actually publicly berate you in the comments if you get anything under a perfect score. Clip one. Here we go. This right, is uh, right. from Coach Ice. The uh, song was Snot. It's called Tell Him. And let's Snot. let's hear what he has to say. Snot. Call up, bro. Like, what we doing? I can't even pick a favorite person. I be calling everybody as a selective. Sometimes I be calling... All right. Sometimes he's, he said he's calling up bro. Sometimes he's calling up bro. Who do you think uh -huh. bro is? I think I think bro might be PewDiePie. You think bro might you think the guy in the Hunter Hunter bubble jacket has <laughs> PewDiePie's number? Would he not? How's it going, bro? He's the only bro I know. Okay, you're locking in PewDiePie. I'm sure. going to say I'm going to say landlord. <laughs> I'm caught I'm caught between Goku or the president. <laughs> 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 Goku's fucking awesome. Goku is insane. I'm going to go with Goku. You're going to go with <laughs> Goku. All right. Let's Truly. <laughs> like the, sometimes I be calling my mom sometimes, bro. Like, what are you doing? Oh, I'm at the grocery store with moms. What are you going to do? Fight me? Do I look corny shopping with my mom? You know what I mean? Are you going to press me about it? So, you know, I'm going to call up bro. That's bro. She bro. That's gang. Mom's is gang. So, you know, I'm going to call her up. Damn. <laughs> I think he said mom's is gay. <laughs> I don't think any of our answers I, can even be. See, close. I disagree. Milo gets think, the point. Yeah, Lambo is right. closest. Your mom owns your house, you know, when you're living Holy there. Holy shit. I'm fucking huge brand. Yeah. That's one point for Milo. Up next, this is Jack Harlow um, many, many, many years ago. White, yep, white boy of the year. Dropping songs specifically tailored for white women. This is before that era. This is What's Popping, the song that sent him into stardom. Um, let's hear what he has to say. Dark hair bitch, she look like she go. She do. She's bad. She's fine as hell. I had a lot of cartoon <laughs> characters that used to get me sexually aroused as a kid. She was one of them. She is one of them. Lola implying Buddy. It's got that there Lola is Buddy. two more. Oh. Okay. They're both from movies you'd watch as a child. I'll give you that much. Okay. Um, Lola Bunny then. Absolutely. And the mom from Incredibles. Okay, fair guesses. Honestly, she was bad. I get it. Both of them she, were bad. She is bad. <laughs> I'm gonna also say Lola Bunny. Okay. Mm. Carpet from Aladdin. The carpet from Aladdin. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, uh, that thing can fold. Lola Bunny. Okay, yeah. fair, fair. <laughs> and Roxanne from a Goofy movie. Roxanne from a Goofy choice. movie. That is that's a really a good choice. That is a good one. Files. I'm pretty sure Martin has showed me this clip. I know it's a curveball, but I can't remember what it is. <laughs> yeah, all right. Let's let's see what he has to say. The female reindeer from the Rudolph <laughs> the series. Thing, yeah. When I was in preschool, I used to be bricked up watching that shit. And then that fine ass fish from Shark Tale. <laughs> dude, dude, okay. Oh I swear, I, Martin, I swear to God, before I said Lola. Bunny, I was gonna say the fish from Shark Tale. <laughs> I guessed two, that's two animals. animals. Give it to Yako, yeah. Let's go. Our, our friend here is back. Uh, nigga better turn me up. 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 I be listening to- He's talking about turning up. He wants to turn up. Okay. What artist does he turn up to? You do know them. Do I? Yes. Taylor Swift. Um, Final answer. Taylor Swift? Okay, good. Honestly, yeah. a solid one. I think he turns up to Coldplay. I'm not confident in this answer, but I'm gonna go with Michael Jackson. All right, so the king of pop, uh, a rock band. No, changing my answers. The oh. Beatles. So like, That's... the rock band. None of you are close. I be listening to a lot of Beethoven to turn me up. <laughs> I be in the car going crazy. Beethoven, Mozart, Bach. I be going crazy to it. I promise you. You know what I mean? It turns you up. It makes you just. The bass to it is just magnificent. The bass magnificent. is mag magnificent. magnificent. Yeah. The Beatles is the oldest the band. Beatles, it, yeah, the so Beatles I will is give like one point iconic. to Milo. This next one's vile. This is. I, I was trying to think of like how to include this one because there's not a good way to stop, but I needed to include this. This right. dude rants for like 30 seconds about 
Well, well you'll hear it. I'll just, I'll just let it play. Oh I could have took his bitch, but her pussy smelled like fish. First of oh. all, like, I was new to the game, especially when it came to females. Like, my first time <laughs> going in, I didn't even think pussy could smell like that. I did not know that. Like, I smelled my finger and it stunk, but it's like, you stink. Like, you smell like. He's gonna, he's gonna say it smells like oh. something fish related, a location that is related to fish. What, what do it be smelling like? Detroit. <laughs> it's really bad that my, my, my brain went like this. Oh, I know, like a, a harbor. Oh, Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor? Oh, no. <laughs> Walking in Pearl that. Harbor. Martin, that's for your next video, dude. Like, bitch smell like Pearl Harbor. Is like <laughs> Pearl Harbor. Harbor. <laughs> dude, that's an insane line. That's unreal. Uh, I'm gonna say a sushi restaurant. All right, let's, let's hear what J.I. here has to say. You smell like SeaWorld, like the shit is Damn. crazy, an aquarium. <laughs> <laughs> That's no. actually objectively probably okay. the easiest one. To it get. probably like, was. Whose location is I don't closest is, to SeaWorld? Uh, does Pearl I mean, do we, Harbor have a SeaWorld? I mean, theoretically, there's probably a sushi restaurant near SeaWorld. But hey, like, let me have this. That would be yeah. fucked up, Yago. <laughs> Wasn't, wait, isn't SeaWorld known for like abusing its animals? Oh yeah. Yes. It was, okay. Yeah, Pearl Harbor wins. Yeah. Pearl Harbor wins. <laughs> Pearl. That's not, that's not a phrase I thought I'd hear in my lifetime. Fifth round already. Okay, Shadi, in my head, I don't do no red. I'm gonna be honest with you. Shadi's in his head. He does not do red, which is a drug. Uh -huh. And he's uh -huh. about to be honest with you. <laughs> he's going to explain why he said that line. I I like exactly why he said it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know. Now, why did this why shit. did he say that? I'm gonna be honest with you. He actually wrote this song while high on red. <laughs> that would that, that'd be an insane twist. Yeah, you know what? He, I want. I think he's gonna say, "I'm gonna be honest with you. I lied." Oh. I don't. I don't think he was on it. I just think he lies. You just think he's a liar. <laughs> I just think he's a liar. I'm gonna guess that. Uh, one time he did drugs and he had an imaginary girlfriend. That's why he said it. She <laughs> That's was why he in said his it? head. But let's hear why he said that line. Let's hear it. I'm gonna be honest with you. It rhymed. I was like, yeah, this is <laughs> I don't do it. Fuck, I don't think anybody gets any points. For no, that, that, one. One, <laughs> that one nobody gets a point. What the fuck? <laughs> this is Amine. Great rapper, love his music. Love Amina. This is about his most popular song, Caroline. Let's hear this journey that he takes. Bad thing, fine as hell. Basically, when I was like five, I signed the Death Row Records. And then basically, I was five, so I signed a shitty deal. Like, I didn't know how to read. You know, come 18, 20, I was like, damn, I gotta make some paper. And I was like, I gotta get myself a sugar mama. So, 20, I, I got myself a sugar mama, and then she sent me out to the Himalayas. And I went to the Himalayas, right? And then she was crazy. I met this Tibet monk. And he was like, yo, um, you know, like, look behind you, bro. And I look behind me and I seen it. Oh, all right. What? What? Tibet, what? The Tibet monk <laughs> tells him to turn around. What? <laughs> Where are we going? The what Tibet the monk fuck? tells him to turn around. What does he see? <laughs> Surely this, you think... can just guess this one, right? It's that easy? I think the Tibet monk is the fucking hottest person that he's ever seen in his life and okay. he instantly falls in love with the tibetan monk i think he turned around and saw uh a nice rock formation that looked like <laughs> just like a wild animal a wild animal <laughs> i don't know what is up in the himalayas a fucking mountain lion but like he's some some <laughs> some animal and he went damn all right let's run it bro and i look behind me and i seen this dragon in the shape of a female and it was crazy and i was like man that's a bad thing he was like yo you should put that in a song and i was like yeah did he say dragon Wait, he said a dragon. dragon for wild animal dragon closest yaku yeah. gets a point yeah, yeah. Gets let's go so this is komatsin very aggressive rapper um and he's about to about to describe this insane line like this is this is martin tier lyricism that's how you know it's good oh fucking jesus okay. eating that time i'm born called it a snicker snicker bars have peanut Peanuts in it. She eat nuts on my bar. So she can call it a snicker. That's just like some. He's about to say, like, how wh how that line makes him feel in comparison to his colleagues. Like, writing that line, how do you think it made him feel? 
Oh god, is he gonna be like, yeah, this is this is my climax. Say, this is a different climax. word, Zombie. <laughs> he's a different word when he's talking about his nuts, his snicker bar nuts. I think he's gonna say that is the worst bar <laughs> I've ever written in my life. He thinks he's Roadrunner. He and everybody else is Wiley Coyote. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know, like everybody's trying to catch him, but he's too fast. He's, too, he's better he's, than he's ahead of the rappers. game. Right, that's what I'm saying. You're right, exactly. But let's hear what Comethazine has to say. Some animated ass, some animated thinking, you feel me? Niggas is not on my level. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> you're right. Hey. Like, you both you both get it. Yeah. What's crazy to me is that he wrote something I would I would write for like my rap lyric series, except he genuinely meant that people, they're just not on his level. For the last clip of the night this gentleman is back this fine gentleman back. we love him he's back he's ready to talk you through a, a beautiful set of bars let's hear it captain bought them bleaks sticks mix chips dips whatever <laughs> baby i'm getting this cheddar <laughs> look it's all right to rap but sometimes you don't need to rap about the blicks you don't need to rap about the sticks now i was talking about like mix like 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 he ain't got hands like that don't lie to me he ain't got no hands i'm talking about so much things that dudes is, is capping about chips he ain't getting this bread he ain't getting this cheddar what are you talking about huh you know dip so he explained chips he explained everything in that list except for dip okay. now my my answer that wouldn't make sense is is tobacco but i was gonna i was gonna say but tobacco. my guess is gonna be women like women. damn it that's what my guess is gonna be <laughs> yeah. too i'm gonna say drugs drugs okay so dip, drugs dip women. Is like you know yeah. you got your chips the bread and drugs is the dip <laughs> i'm gonna say that dip for him is fucking tobacco i don't fucking know I'm gonna be honest, for this last round, I thought I'd throw you a softball because you're not ready for what he's about to say. You know, dip, dip just rhymed. You know what I mean? God, so it's like, you know, whatever. You know, me, a guy like me, maybe I'm getting this cheddar. You know what I mean? So it, it, it goes it just rhymed. It just rhymed. <laughs> it just rhymed. It just rhymed. Okay, it just you rhymed. that twice. Final scores Milo has two points, Condi has. Two points yeah. and Yako, yeah. the champion of the first ever genius, ba bad genius. I don't yeah. have a series name. <laughs> <laughs> bad genius yes. interviews with three whole points. Woo! Congratulations. Yeah. Add to my it. Twitter banner oh. permanently. I gotta start thinking about it. The left side needs more love, but here it is. Yeah! <laughs> yes! 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 <laughs> oh, it's yes! beautiful. <laughs> oh, this this is the first time that I have gotten my banner back and have been happy to update it. <laughs> oh, this is lovely. This is exactly what I wanted. And just like that, he's there. Oh, he's so God happy. Bless. Let's go. So happy.